Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. It is the first video that we are doing since I demolished most of Hull. Uh, and yeah, we've put this new amazing sort of tram depot, bus depot. Oh look, I hadn't actually noticed but there's a lorry there carrying an old tram away. Oh, that's heartbreaking, isn't it? We've got e Citaros over here. They're all the stock models that come with the game. Uh, some sort of funky little bendy buses down here. Amazing. Uh, but yeah, we put this in because this is going to be our new sort of amazing thing that happens, isn't it? This is going to be how we're going to connect Hull. So what we're going to do is we're going to find a way to connect all of this up. Now, I've got the game paused at this precise moment in time because, well, for obvious reasons, really. Uh, we're going to connect you there. Right, hang on, that's, that's good. Right, a bit of that. Yeah, lovely. And we'll also have a little bit of that down there. Lovely, so we can get that there. Now, if I upgrade this, because we've got the one-way track, so we want to keep the track on one side of the road. It seems a little bit odd to do it on both. Now this is uh, this is where we're gonna see this road. We need this road to sort of continue on, don't we? So if we go go for a bit of that, right? We don't need the tram track, I don't think. Oh, hang on, how do we? Can we? How about a bit of straight track? There we go. Look, look at that. That's lovely. We might actually be able to get some buildings up here. So if I build that on there, we'll delete this. And then we can upgrade. Right, right, hang on. Right, bit of bit of track. No, not track. Right, there we go. We'll, we'll have a bit of that. Put you on there. Lovely. And then this can be the new road into Hull. How's that? I mean, there's too many tram tracks there for a start. But this can be... Right, if we leave you there... Let's just get rid of the tram track, shall we? Here, because we don't need it. Then we'll sort of do a bit of that. And a bit of that. And then if we go for our country roads, we can upgrade the country road to be four. Four lane. There we go. Right, there we go. Right, that's not going to work. Excellent. Right, okay. Delete you. Oh, hang on. Right. See, this isn't going to work, is it? Being four lane all the way. Bit of lag. Goodness me. Right. Uh, come on, stop lagging. Right, we'll we'll bring... We'll have a bit of straight track there. Straight road, even. Lovely. This is like a proper mega upgrade, isn't it? Right, you there and there. So the buses can still stop, can't they? If we've got... Uh, right, they're both on the same... Yeah, I don't want them both to be on the same line. How do we... There we go, bus hull. So three... Ah, right, okay, so is it starting down here? No, hang on, six. So six needs to move, five needs to move to the other side of the road, does it? Yeah, that's probably what we're getting at there. So five needs to move to terminal two. Need a bit more road. Yeah, hang on, nope, not be, uh, don't be straight road. There we go, and same again, connect you onto there. Can we just upgrade the rest of that? We can. Wow, okay, it's keeping it. Right, how about a bit of bit of four-lane road here? Just to there, that'll do. Right, you're not actually on the track either, are you? So the trains can keep coming past. We'll just four-lane you to there. That's awesome, and then they can sort of spread out doing their own thing. And then this road here, we'll have a little bit of a little bit of this. Lovely stuff. That's good. Right, okay, so hypothetically, oh hang on, we need we need to upgrade this road, yeah, bit of, bit of that, lovely, and a tram line with electric, right, okay, so is everyone working now? No, because this tram route here is not okay, so if we, if we delete that, but then put that in there, that's going to work, isn't it, bit of, bit of tram up there, so the tram can do a full circle, in fact... We don't need you to go down there because that's the last stop. So we can bring you up there and sort of have you weaving in like that. Now, have we got any... Right, okay, so these all can't be connected, which is a problem. What if I play the game? There we go. If we set things moving... Whoa, that is a lot of lag. Are we... Right, okay, so the bus hull to Beverly. 
Why can't they all be connected? Right. Oh, hang on. Yeah, it's still squawking. No path, no path, no path electric. Right, let's go with the tram. Go for Terminal 7. And then the tram there. Terminal 6. How's that? So this is... Are we going to drop people off here? Should we, should we go Terminal 5? I mean, this... Oh, hang on. The bus seems to be... Right, hang on. So you can go in Terminal 2. You can go in Terminal 3. Terminal 4. And Terminal 5. How's that? Is, is that... What, what's that? Bus hull to Ferriby cannot connect all stations. Well, why not? Springfield Road. It's a whole branch. Where's that? Oh, well, why... What if we go six? No. What about four? Oh, it can do four. Oh, because I think I've got that bus stopping in the tram stop. Right, okay. Well, that seems to be... That seems to be working. Are you going to come down this side of the road as well? Oh, you are. That is brilliant. So the trams are actually going to come down different sides of the road. I mean, it's nice and slow in here, isn't it? What are you doing over there? Why, why can't you... Why can't you just turn left? Do we know? Does anybody know? I'm not sure. These buses are all stuck together. Wow, look at that. We've got a, got the traffic going already. People are walking across. This is... Oh, they're actually going into the terminal. Hang on. Well, well, where do you come out when you pop in there? Do you, do you go under and sort of appear over here? I don't know. Where do they all sort of go? Is there a... Like a lift? No? Do they all pop out of here and then have to walk all the way around? That would be quite uh, quite something, wouldn't it? Can we can we actually go inside the building? No, we can't zoom in far enough. But they all seem to be getting here somehow. Oh, they're all just appearing on the platforms. That's... Whoa, look at that. All those people, all the haters that said that this was awful. I think... That you are about to eat your own words. Look at that. That is a thing of beauty, all these buses. I mean, I'm having a thing there. Right, okay. And there is one other super exciting thing that I have got to show you today. Uh, which I have been sent a beta. And I really, really hope this works. If it doesn't, it is a beta, people. So, uh, so yeah, be nice about it. Because it's brilliant in every way, shape or form. And you shall see why it is brilliant. What on earth is going on here? Good lord, where are all these cars coming from? Got some right traffic coming in here, haven't we? That is a problem, queuing over the bridge there. Where are they coming from? Right, hang on, so you... Where do you live? You live in Hornsea. You live in Ellaby. So those are up here, aren't they? Hornsea and Ellaby. Oops. Is there a way that we could... I mean, these guys are busy, aren't they? They're, they're really busy. We can't really improve it anyway, can we? Hmm. We haven't got an awful lot coming from Heden, have we? Oh, wow, we are actually still on dirt roads down here, so let's just get that upgraded. Uh, hang on, why are we... Should we go for this, seeing as... Why can't we upgrade it? Am I being thick here? Probably. There we go. Yeah, we'll use that rug because that's the same same material. Again, oh, look at that. That's that's not good. I mean, this place here, Winestead and Withensee, are completely cut off from the rest of the map. So you can't actually drive from these towns. Maybe that's why they've not grown that much. I mean, look, that doesn't have a road at all. Alright, tell you what we'll do. We'll upgrade these. Hopefully these will grow a bit bigger. Oh, hang on. Right, there we go. Bit of that. Right, we'll, we'll connect all this up. Yeah, lovely. Oh, wow. 150 stroke 2 and transport for Wales livery. Right, hang on. You need to be smaller road because you can't actually fit a bigger road. That's fine. Bigger road... 
you can just sort of connect to there like that. In fact, I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll, we'll... Why is that road straight across the middle of that field? That's not very nice, is it? Oh, wow, we're getting some, uh, some West Midlands stock as well. This can go all the way up the coast to there. Lovely. And we can have another road that comes down here. I realise this is probably doing our trains out of business here, but... It's one of them you do need to... What has happened with the scenery there? That's not... Uh, yeah, what, what are all these lines? Oh, I don't know. But yeah, it's just meaning that people can actually... You know, we're a little bit more connected. You can come... Whoops, where are we? Around there, yeah, lovely. Seven car unit of anti-west coast. Wow. So these are 197s, aren't they? Well, what could we... Uh, could we actually do something with these if we've got some sort of fictional northern trains livery? The paces could be repro uh, reproduced. Re, uh, replaced. That's the one. That's what I'm looking for. Right, let's have a look at what we've got. British Rail 196. Wow, so we've got connects. Northern. How many can they carry? 33? Yeah, that, that's not going to cut the mustard, is it, on here? Have we got a three-car unit? Four-car unit? Northern. That can carry 75. Is it fast? Well, I don't know. Let's have a look, because we'll, we'll compare it with the 142. So it's got, so it can do 99, 1,560 and 48, uh, 480. That's, wow, that is, uh, yeah, that's that's not an awful lot. So these will be a lot faster if we do these, but they can't carry as much. It's one of them, innit? Should we just go for it? Let's, let's just go for it. Right, okay. This is going to look weird, but obviously this is going to be, we're pretending that this is a 195, aren't we, really? I mean, ignore the fact it's crashed into the uh, into the building there. I wonder what this is. I wonder what the sounds are like on these. I don't think I've ever used these before, ever. They're not bad. Ignore the fact that they're, uh, they've are they got orange doors inside. This is right, little rocket. We might actually upgrade all of these. Now, I was thinking, because people had asked for the Tyne and Weir Metro, I was thinking of converting one of these lines. We've got any trains at all running down here. Yeah, we have. There we go. So these are both going to be, they're going to be exactly the same. Wow, Northern Spirit. That's a bit funky, isn't it? Uh, right, hang on. Two car unit. Have we got a three car unit? Three car unit. Um... No, we haven't. It's wow. <laughs> London North Eastern, Trans Pennine Express, four car unit. I'd, I'd, you see, if we had a three car unit in Northern, I'd like to use four and threes. Thirty-three, though, it's not good enough, is it? Really, we'll, we'll stick with the four-car units then, if that's all we're gonna get. We can fit seventy-five on. That'll do. Nope, oh, this is uh, yeah, this this isn't good. It's a shame we can't get the three-car units. I'd like that. But yeah, we've had a, a right little upgrade down this corridor. Look at that. We could actually right. Can we can we up the line speed? Right, hang on. Yeah, bit of that. What can we currently do? I think it's 60, isn't it? Yeah, it's 60 all the way down. Tell you what, we'll, we'll go for... No, no electrification, because we don't need that. We'll go for a bit of 90. Just to speed things up, because then, hopefully, people will not want to drive. Right, that's only 73 and 74, so we'll go for 70 round, right, 70 to there, through the town. That's, I think that's more than reasonable, really, isn't it? Right, we'll go, we'll go for a bit of that. 70, 70, and then it can whiz up to 90 here. All the way around the corner, this can stay at 90, because this is, I mean, this is the busier route of the two, isn't it? 
So you can do 90 all the way down to there, where you can do 75 around the corner. And then, can we do 80? Bit of 80? No. 70 is, uh, is what is the order of the day. And then we can do a bit of 90 from there, can't we? I mean, that is a real upgrade, isn't it? Our trains are going to be running so much quicker. There we go. And then round here, this little branch can... Uh, tell you what, what have we got there? So that'll be... That's 58, isn't it? There, 60. What about a bit of 90 from there? That's not going to like it. Oh, it is actually taking 90. That's brilliant. It's not going to get to 90, is it? Let's face it. What's that little 15 bit? Oh, is it from when it was single track? Did it used to be single track? I can't remember. It's that long ago. Oh, hang on. 73. Right, so we'll have that at 70. Just have that at 70, uh, 70 for the rest of it. That'll do. Right, so is that going to be any better? I mean, it's going faster than 60 odd, which is what the paces could do. Right, well, this is actually not what I wanted to show you. Uh, so, I mean, you're probably going to have guessed what it was by the, the thumbnail of the video, let's face it. Uh, we'll actually just double check how these guys are doing. Oh, my lord. Right, okay. So, uh, yeah, we could do with getting rid of these traffic lights. Just to improve, sort of, everything. I mean, that's that's not really improved anything, has it? But, uh, right, have we got a, uh, have we got anything that... Right, hang on, whole branch. Do we need a new route? I feel like we do need a new route. We'll have, like, a cross-town route in. Because we don't have any stops around here, do we, covering this new area? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for a... Uh, right, we'll go for a stop... ...here. Which we don't actually need this, do we? So we'll uh, we'll take this tram line... We'll take this tram route out. There we go, that's fine. Have a bit of that there. Put that in there. So that's going to stop there. It's going to go into the... Tell you what, we'll... What are we having now? Yeah, I don't really know where we're going to sling that. I mean, we could put that there. Can, can they... Yeah, we'll, we'll go for that. Yep. And then you can go up there, yeah, up to that stop. And then they can do like a little lap round, like that. Lovely. Right, okay, so, new route across town in Hull. Right, we're going to go there, there, there. Round to here in the centre of town, up to there, up here, and then just do a little lap round. There we go. Right, and then round there and back again. So this will be bus, uh, Hull, city bus. That'll do. Right, okay, where's the depot? Oh, we've got depot here. Let's, uh, let's go for that. So if I, uh, if I go passenger buses, right, let's scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. Look at this. We have a right eclipse urban, people. Uh, First West Yorkshire, oh, left-hand drive, First West Yorkshire, Barbie. Uh, Mark 1, 2005, when First West Yorkshire, Barbie, livery freak number 66780, YG05BBZ. It's my bus. Uh, this bus is now presented by well-known transport fever enjoyer, Joe Dobson. Look at that. I have actually had my bus made for me in this game. I haven't actually had my bus made. He was making it anyway, uh, and I just pestered him, saying, will you put my livery on it? So, uh, yeah, let's let's see. Now, again, this is a beta, so this might crash the game, but it hasn't. Look at this. Right, we've got a bus coming out. Ha, ha, ha. That is incredible. Wee. 
That is absolutely incredible. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm honestly like a kid in a candy shop right now. That is amazing. I've not actually seen this particular version in game. Um, I mean, look at that. We've got the interior. It's properly left hand drive. We've got all the seat maquette and everything. This is incredible. I don't know when this is going to be available on the workshop, but this is the same model that we actually use in City Bus Manager. It was ported over from Transport Fever. But look at that. Yeah, so I'd, I'd love to tell you when it's out. We've got the Volvo Eclipse logos on the back. Oh, wow. Uh, CW315, what an amazing, amazing uh, creator he is. I'm, I'm so excited. That, that is amazing. They're all going to be getting in the way of the street decks now, aren't they? They should just come down the outside. Oh no, you're coming down here. Where do the trams actually go when they've been round the outside? They have to... Uh... Where are you going? I don't actually know where the trams go. Oh, they come through the depot. And sort of round. Ah, I see. It's a bit of a long way about doing it, doesn't it? They have eclipses in the game. That is so cool. So, so cool. As I say, this particular version can carry 20 passengers. You just have to ignore the fact they turn around and tap that lamppost down. Why has this road come about? That's annoying. There's a lot of stuff turning up here now. It's got working indicators. Oh my lord. Oh, there's a crash. Dear in me. That's not good. <laughs> God, there's trams everywhere. There's buses everywhere. Hull is just mental at the moment, isn't it? I mean, like I say, we've got the we've got six buses on that, haven't we? I don't think that is going to be the busiest route of all time. Although, to be fair, that seems to be... Whoa, what is going on here? So Hull, Ellaby, Hull, Beverly. This could really do with sort of... Yeah adjusting so that because there's a bit of a queue going on here isn't there how's that traffic going on wow the traffic is gone so these new northern services must really have oh, you see that's full hull to hornsey shuttle which is this one I mean, we're doing 78. Look at that. 80 miles an hour. This is the fastest we've ever gone down here. Because the Pacers could never get to 75, could they? I don't think they ever did. I could be wrong. That's actually adjust the timetable as well. Hull to Hornsey shuttle uh, train. Hull to Hornsey shuttle. Uh, unbunch time, 3.31. Yeah, that's, that's pretty fine. I want to see how fast this is going to run into town now. Right, that is full. We've still got 46 waiting. So yeah, we could could ideally do with an extra train on the circuit, couldn't we? I mean, we could make these... Tell me what we'll do. We'll, uh, right, manage vehicles. Edit. Because if we're leaving 45 behind, that's, that's all right, isn't it? So northern, 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 northern. Hang on, we're on four car. Where's my two cars? Yeah. South, west and south east. Right, one, two, three, four... There we go. We'll make them all six cars. They can all carry 108. Look at that. So it's going to be a two car stuck to a four car. I'm really hoping, I mean, we've got enough space down here at Hornsey to turn around, haven't we? I'm just hoping that we've got enough space at, uh, at Hull. Because I know we've got some shorter platforms, haven't we? Look at this, though. He's absolutely going for it. I'm so thrilled! A proper, like, not high speed, but quicker, much quicker. Look at him, he's doing 70. Flying over the bridge into Hull now. I want to actually see how quick he's going to go. So he's uh, 72. 
Coming down here, flying down here. This used to, of course, be 60. Oh, no, he's slowing down. I mean, that 196 model's really, really good. Is it by Kelmy or Selmy? One of the two. Ah, that is a problem. Right, that's not fitting. Right, we can't fit a six car, people. It was a good idea, but it doesn't fit. So we'll get rid of that. Oh, hang on. What's what's this? Right, get rid of that. Yeah, you're all four cars again. We'll just add another one onto the circuit. There we go. So the Hull to Hornsey shuttle actually only has seven waiting, because I think one of them's just gone. Yeah, that's a Hull Hornsey shuttle, isn't it? With, uh, with how many on, sorry? 75 out of 75. So yeah, an extra train on the circuit should be fine. But what we'll do is we will go here. And there we go. Right, manage line. Nope, that's not the one. Right, timetable. So now it's 2.51, so we'll go for 2.30. Yeah, lovely. Little trains and lots of them. What we could actually do is go for a bit of four track out of here, but it would mean having to rebuild all these bridges so that this can just branch off and... And sort of do its own thing. Where's the latest train there? 49 out of 75. I mean, that capacity down this line is fine. They're fairly small, small little towns, aren't they? It's nice to see the roads have been used, though. I wonder what this is going to get to in terms of speed. I wonder, could we actually upgrade this junction? I don't think we can. What are we, uh, what are we currently doing in terms of speed around here? This is 50. Can we get 60 out of it? We can. Right, hang on. Just pop that back to 90. There we go. Right, you're back at 90. Right, we've got 60. Can we Can we get 70? No. We can only get 60. That's fine. But 60 is still better than, than nothing. How about 90 there and there? 85, right. We can go to 80 and then 90, can't we? Just to give them as, as much chance to speed up as possible. And it's still 10 mile an hour faster than it was. I mean, they're so cool, aren't they? Hulter Hornsey Shuttle, nobody on. I mean, loads of you have complained that you don't like the paces, so so this is an upgrade. It's a hell of an upgrade, isn't it? Uh, right, what are we happening here? What's happening here? Bus hull to Beverly. Yeah, the, uh, the the loading time is quite a while. The Eclipse is very much holding up traffic. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll go for another road down there, like that. Lovely. Bit of that. Have another bus stop here. Grange Road and Mill Road. Right, okay. So the bus hull to Beverly. Are they, I think they're the most frequent, aren't they? There's a lot of buses on there. Right, 4 and 12. So 4. We'll add that in there. And 11 or 12 can now be... There we go, right, click on stations to add. That's better. Right, you can just go there now. So they can change. I know it's a totally different stop, but they can they can do that. Just for, uh, yeah, hold to Beverly. You're going to go past now, aren't you? I mean, that, that's, it's not ideal, is it? But, I mean, hang on, which, which way do you go? So you go around there. So, yeah, that, that does work pretty well, to be fair. Oh, wow, look at these guys here. Oh, you're still a four coach and are hanging off the platform. Well, can I just ask us to... Oh, right, okay, yeah. Turns out we can't fit a four coach on. That is really annoying. See, so if we had a three, if they made them as a three, that would be perfect. I can hear a 350 as well. Where is he? Oh, he's there. Fantastic. Plenty of people on. Pacers keeping the uh, keeping the service moving. 
Well, what we might have to do is move the pacers back onto... No, because we, we can't move the pacers back onto this line. We've just had a massive upgrade. Oh, look at that. Lots waiting. 64. How many of you got on? 75. Not good. Right, well, that is where we're going to leave it for today. I do hope you have enjoyed uh, today's video. We are going to... You know what? I'm intrigued by the Tyne and Weir thing and having underground stations in Hull and, and stuff like that. I'm just not quite sure how I'm going to do it, to be honest with you. Uh, but, yeah, I do hope you have enjoyed today's video. Uh, thank you so, so much for watching. I, uh, I also hope that you enjoyed this as a, as a sort of concept. I think it looks pretty good outside Hull. Uh, obviously, it's going to take a while for the buildings to all build back. Uh, that's going to have some houses around it. Although I think when they do, that's going to look fairly decent. What's going on here? You, you've actually... You're the Hull Horns. Or you're the, ah, you're the Hull Withensy. I see. I see. No pun intended. But uh, yeah, uh, let me know what you think in the comments section. Click the like button and do consider subscribing if you haven't already. Other than that, thanks so, so much for watching. And hopefully I shall see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.